I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, everybody. Hi. All right, item number one. I make a motion to approve the minutes from the October 9th meeting. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Arnold, second by Commissioner Warren to approve the minutes of the October 9th meeting. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 So carried. Item 2. Make a motion to recess Commissioner's meeting. Open salary board at still 9 a.m. I'll second that motion. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to recess Commissioners and open the salary board. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Under the salary board. Item number one. Oh. Don't be a long meeting, folks. I'll make a motion to approve the minutes from the October 9th meeting. I'll second that motion. I'll just read down. Salary board. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Sixth motion down. And the motion was made by Commissioner Arnold, but she did not second it. That was seconded by Commissioner Warren. Are you okay with that change? Yeah. With that change being made, any other questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. So carried. Item number two. I'll make the motion to approve the change in the miscellaneous compensation schedule, increasing the hourly rate for court appointed counsel to $70, effective January 1st, 2020, for the recommendation of the present judge. Well, unfortunately, you can't make that one. I can't? Why not? <laughs> because it's. Because uh, it's. Uh, <laughs> it's shout out, Kathy. <laughs> <laughs> I'll read it. All right. Well, then I will rescind it. <laughs> <laughs> I let her do it. All I right. motion for number two on the salary. All right. So Kathy is making that second. one. Oh, well, I'll second it. <laughs> All right, motion by Kathy Holly, seconded by District Attorney O'Malley. To approve item two on the agenda to change the miscellaneous compensation schedule for the court appointed counsel to seventy dollars. It was, I believe, sixty. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Number three. I make a motion to approve item number three as listed on the agenda. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Warren, signed by Commissioner Arnold, approved item three on the agenda to create a full time non union position of director of public facilities, annual salary of 45000 40 hours minimum, effective November 7th. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. So carried. Item number four. Make a motion to approve item number four as listed on the agenda. Second. Motion by Commissioner Warren, signed by District Attorney O'Malley, to approve item four on the agenda to create a temporary part time union position of manager of special projects, $22 an hour, not more than 1,000 hours per year, and not to exceed 29 hours per week, effective January 2nd, 2020. Questions or comments? And so, just to clarify so everybody knows, our uh, current director of uh, maintenance is retiring at the end of the year, so that's why the new position is being created now for cross training and then he will move into a temporary position on special projects so that we uh, have the coverage on the special projects. With that being said, all in favor? Aye. 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 Item number five. I'll make a motion to approve item number five. It's listed <coughs> on the agenda. Second. 
motion by Commissioner Warren, second by District Attorney O'Malley, uh, to approve item 5, correct the title from the 2010 Oh, sorry. Sally Board from First Deputy Register Recorder to First Deputy Register of Wills. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Item number 6. I'll make motion for motion number 6. I'll second it. Motion by District Attorney O'Malley, uh, second by Commissioner Warren, approved item 6, change the starting salary for the full-time non-union position of County Detective Narcotics K-9 Handler from 40000 to 50000 annually. Is it the starting or the current? It'll be, well, it'll be starting, that'll be changing the salary already, make it the, uh, the current, so it becomes both. Effective October 24th for the recommendation of District Attorney O'Malley. <coughs> Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Any public comments on the salary board? Hearing none, item 7. I'll make a motion to close at 9.06. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Warren, Senator Commissioner Hall. Close the salary board, return to the commissioners. At 9.06. All in favor? Aye. Aye. And I'm sure everybody has things to do. You're more than welcome to leave. But if you want to stay for the entertainment, okay. you can. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, back to the uh, commissioners meeting at 9.06. Item number three. I'll make a motion to approve <coughs> item number three is listed on the agenda. <coughs> I'll second that motion. Motion by Commissioner Warren. by Commissioner I'll approve item three on the agenda. To ratify and approve the following cash disbursements or electronic payments. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. So carried. Item four. Motion to approve item number four. Second. Motion by Commissioner Arnold, second by Commissioner Warren, approve item four on the agenda to ratify and approve the following seminar request and or payment for seminar request as so stated. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 So carried. Item five. I make a motion to approve item number five as listed on the agenda. I'll second that motion. Motion by Christian Warren, second by Christian Warren, approve item 5 on the agenda. Acknowledge with regret the resignation of Celine Herman from the position of the Sheriff's Real Estate Clerk, effective November 1st, 2019, for the recommendation of Sheriff Plans Manager. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 <coughs> item 6. I make a motion to approve item number 6 is listed on the agenda. I'll second that. Motion by Christian Warren, second by Christian Warren, approve item 6. Acknowledge the extension of the temporary position of Virginia Smith as part-time juvenile probation administrative assistant through October 30th, 2019, for the recommendation of <coughs> President Judge Jason Light. Questions or comments? All in favor? Uh, Aye. I make a motion to approve item number seven on the agenda. Second. Motion by Commissioner Arnold, second by Commissioner Warren, approve item 7 on the agenda, except with regret the resignation of Dennis Landis from the position of maintenance supervisor effective end of January 1st, 2020. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Item number 8. I'll make a motion to approve item number 8 as listed on the agenda. I'll second that motion. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold, approve item 8 to approve the hiring of Dennis Landis to the open part time temporary non union position of manager of special projects. $22 per hour, not more than 1,000 hours a year, and not to exceed 29 hours a week, effective January 2nd, 2020. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 So created. Item 9. I'll make a motion to approve item number 9 as listed on the agenda. I'll second that motion. Motion by Christian Warren, second by Christian Arnold, approve item 9 on the agenda, approve the transfer of James Hawley to the open full time non union position of Director of Public Facilities, 45000 per year. Effective November 7th, 2019. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. So carried. Item number 10. I'll make a motion to approve item number 10 as listed on the agenda. <coughs> I'll second that motion. <coughs> Motion by Christian Warren, second by Christian Arnold, approve item 10 on the agenda, ratify and approve the hiring of Carrie Guzzi of Montrose to the open hourly non union position of DPS operations manager. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 So carried. Uh, the next one, 11, has a uh, change in the language. It should say to amend from the October 9th, 2019 meeting. I'll make that motion. I'll second it. 
Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to approve item 11 to amend from the October 9th, 2019 meeting the title of William Miles from First Deputy Register and Recorder, First Deputy Recorder of Wills. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Item 12. Make a motion to approve item number 12 is listed on the agenda. I'll second that motion. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to approve item 12 on the agenda to adopt resolution 2019-06. Entering into a cooperative agreement with Treehab for the administration of the Pennsylvania Housing Affordability and Rehabilitation Enhancement Funds Program for the year 2020. Questions and comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Item 13. Make a motion to approve item number 13. <coughs> it's listed on the agenda. I'll second that motion. Aye. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Warren, approve item 13 on the agenda to adopt resolution 2019 07, authorizing Treehab to file. A proposal for Pennsylvania Affordable and Rehabilitation Enhancement Funds, the amount of $1 million to provide, develop, and sustain senior housing units in Bridgewater Township. Questions or comments? Yes, sir. Has there ever been an audit of Treehab? Yeah, they, well, they get audited on federal and on state, by federal and state auditors. So, yes, they do. <clears throat> All in favor? Aye. 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 Item 14. I'll make a motion to approve <coughs> item number 14 as listed on the agenda. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to approve item 14 <coughs> to adopt resolution 2019 08 authorizing Tree Habit File Proposal for Pennsylvania Housing Affordability and Re Rehabilitation Enhancement Funds, the amount of $125,000 to administer a rental and a utility assistance program. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Item 15. I'll make a motion to approve item number 15 as listed on the agenda. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to approve item 15 on the agenda to adopt resolution 2019-09, entering into a cooperative agreement with the Susquehanna mm -hmm. County Housing Redevelopment Authority for administration of Pennsylvania Housing Affordability and Rehabilitation Enhancement Program for 2020. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Item 16. I'll make a motion to approve <coughs> item number 16 as listed on the agenda. I'll second that motion. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to approve item 16 on the agenda to adopt resolution 2019-10. Um, can we in please include the Susquehanna <coughs> County Housing and Redevelopment Authority, is that correct? Yes. Can you file that change, Lizzie? Yes, and we're putting up right above. <coughs> uh, <coughs> Well, okay, motion to adopt resolution 2019-10 for the Susquehanna County Housing and Redevelopment Authority authorizing filing of a proposal for Pennsylvania housing affordability and rehabilitation enhancement funds in about 995,000. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 <coughs> Item 17. <coughs> I'll make a motion to approve <coughs> item number 17 as listed on the agenda. I'll second that motion. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to approve item 17 to adopt resolution 2019-11, reauthorizing the collections of fees to the abandoned mine land reclamation fund. Uh, Questions yeah. or comments? All in favor? Aye. Aye. 18. I make a motion to approve <coughs> item number 18 on the agenda. <coughs> I'll second that. <coughs> motion by Commissioner Arnold, second by Commissioner Warren to approve item 18 to approve proclamation 2019-24, Montrose Business and Professional Women's Club, National Business Women's Week, October 5th, 21st through the 25th, 2019. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Item 19. I'll make a motion to approve item number 19 as listed on the agenda. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Warren, second by Commissioner Arnold to approve Proclamation 2019-25, Nellie Jane DeWitt, Business and Professional Women's Club, National Business Women's Week, October 21st through 25th, 2019. We have questions Mary or Michala. comments? We have Thank Mary Mutala here. Should give yeah. it to him. Yeah. Can we get an eye on it? So they ain't done yet. We'll give them to you in a second. We've got to get them to sign. I'm staying until the end of it. All right. <laughs> All right, thank you. <laughs> All in favor? Aye. Aye. Aye.
Okay. Item 20. Make a motion to approve <coughs> item number 20. Is listed on the agenda? I'll second that. Watch my Christian warrants and my Christian honor approve item 20 on the agenda to enter into an agreement with the Kohansky Company, PA, PC, Music PA, to audit the financials for Susquehanna County for years ending December 31st, 2019, 2020, 2021, with fees per year of 39041 respectively. Questions or comments? All in favor? Aye. 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 Item 21. I'll make a motion to approve item number 21. Is this still on the agenda? I'll second that. Okay, motion number 21, <clears throat> set the millage, motion by Commissioner Warren, signed by Commissioner Allen, set the millage for the year 2020 for Susquehanna County as follows. 10.5 mills for general real estate for the general fund, and 0.33 mills for the library fund, total millage at 10.83. Questions or comments? And this is how many years at this level now? 15. 15 years? So it's staying stable at it's the same rate as it's been for 15 years, <coughs> which I think is pretty remarkable. So, all in favor? Aye. 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 Note on the agenda the Susquehanna County proposed budget for 2020, totaling $46,140,863.37, will be available starting November 4th, 2019, for review in the lobby of the Susquehanna County Courthouse as well as the four public library branches. Proposed budget will be considered for adoption on December 11th, 2019 at the regular commissioner's meeting. <coughs> that said, public comment. Yes, sir. On the list, um, the proposed budget, is there an increase in last year's budget? Uh, there, let's see, how, what's the best way to answer that? The operational budget has a small increase in it. Um, operational budget runs about twenty-two and a half million dollars, almost twenty-three now. Um, overall budget is up because of additional pass-through money, additional grants, additional programming that we've been able to get funding for to push on through. So that's why the total budget itself is up. The um, operational budget's up because of uh, increase in our health insurance. We have an eleven percent increase in the coming year for our health insurance premiums. Um, and also, uh, we're going to put a little bit more money in our pension fund because they've changed the mortality rates, and so it's created a little bit more of a liability, so we want to keep that 100% funded. So with that being said, we were also able to bring in additional grants. Uh, we know of at least uh, half a million dollars worth of additional grants that we've gotten, which helps us set a lot of the costs so we don't have a tax increase. One more question. Um, <coughs> one of the, uh, the trips that one of the law enforcement is making is to learn more about human trafficking. Do we have that, any evidence of that in this county? I, I do know that um, there's been conversations between the detectives and with the state police. Um, you know, the problem you have is you have the Interstate 81 corridor. So as far as inside the towns themselves, uh, um, I'm not hearing much information as to uh, an issue, but I do know 81 Corridor is always a major concern and that they, they do keep a close eye on that. Pretty sad. It's sad, yes. You saw what happened to that lady down in, on the one island. I don't know if you've been watching the national news or not, but the, I can't remember which island it was on. Some island down in the uh, lower part of the the world, but uh, she was a person that was investigating human trafficking and uh, was actually shot outside her house. So, pretty sad thing. It's closer to home than you think. Right. And it's hiding in plain sight, too. Yeah. And that's what's really scary about it. Right. Sounds Any? like you've taken classes. Sounds like you've been educated. You've been educated. <laughs> <Feel some edu> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's really Any scary. other questions or comments? <coughs> well, nothing to think. I'm going to keep quiet today. <laughs> wow. wow. <laughs> That's a first. <coughs> okay, hearing none. Motion to adjourn. I'll second that motion. A motion by Chris Warren, second by Chris Warren. Join the meeting. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Aye at 919. <coughs> Almost made it. One of those, right? You guys get signed. Yeah. I'll do that. <coughs> One of those going there.
Yeah. 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 Yeah.